are at uh, the part of the zoo that caters for the lions and I've been told that they have about 10. So you're going to get into it, get their story, understand why the 10 and why each individual lion matters. I just can't imagine. Landlord, come over. <laughs> so this is beef. Hi. See how it's looking so innocent. Behind me is the only hospital that caters for the wild animals in Uganda. This is a surgical table. Just like us humans, they equally have uh, surgical tables. Jennifer Nandutu has worked with UEK for about 13 years and that simply means that for every single day of these 13 years she's been interacting with the animals and she loves it, she's excited about it and she's not planning to leave anytime soon. No, no. <laughs> So this is what the, the animal keepers do on a daily. They are simply picking the food to go feed the giraffes. I've just done this for five minutes and I'm tired. So if they're doing it on a daily, commendable job. So when you're an animal keeper, this is likely to be your, your way of movement, I would say, right? Every single time you have to pick the giraffe, say, browser, that is the food for the giraffes and you find yourself seated in this comfortable space. As you can see, I'm chilling with the big boys, uh, Mr. Mutesigans. It's, it's, it's an amazing experience. So if you haven't been to this center, make it a point to, to visit it before this year ends. Giraffes eat a lot, they browse a lot, because back in the wild, these animals uh, can eat from morning to morning. We have to do all what it takes so that we can supplement on what they feed on every day. 